Hi all. So I am um, again here to present this topic that is how to retrieve retire a value in RPG program. So we have uh, we can retrieve a retire a value either in CL or an RPG program. So here we discuss on a specific area that is related to RPG only. So let me show you. We have an opcode in which we use to read the data area and this is an opcode out to write to the data area and it basically even if we write or update data area using out we basically unlock a data area so here you can see i defined a ds based upon the data area my dtara1 so this is the data area which we can see using dsp dtara command uh, which is of length 10 character type data area and having this value so, so we can see the, the, the subfield is name of 10 character because this is of 10 length so I define the name subfield as 10 length so I am reading this using in and then displaying that name what I, whatever I am receiving So let's see. Just compile this using star source. Just debug this. So let's see. So we are basically uh, uh, didn't read the data area using in till now. We are on that line. So just first check. The lock. So you won't find any lock on this till the time you are not applying a lock. So whenever you are using, uh, reading or defining this data area using you then you would be seeing that the data area is logged when the initialization subroutine gets executed or during the initialization of this program that is at the starting. So you can see this is not logged right now. Now once I read this. Again you will see I have not logged this one because I have not used a style lock with this as you can see here. So just display the name, name is this and now let's change this name here only. Just update this. So you would not be seeing the lock since you have not applied the lock but this command would release any lock if there were already in on the data area. So let me see the data area value. Now I am applying the lock here. So let me show you the lock. So you can see that the exclusive exclude read lock is there on this data area through this job whose scope is a star job. So once I use out e or out data area once I use this opcode I would be removing that lock there on the program 
or if I, if I am not using that so once analog gets set to on or the program ends I would be seeing no locks on this data area anymore so here you can see that how I retrieve the data area value in RPG program using in opcode and you saw the fun the way the locks work so that's all in this video thank you and have a nice time